Hello, my name is Basil Peppermint Coriander, political contributor to the play Camry, Wales' own party. My goal is to provide only the most thorough and detailed analysis of the powers in charge of the Welsh government and legislature. A somewhat underrepresented party, the Plague Camry focuses on, on the liberties and rights of the Welsh citizens. I was fortunate enough to secure interviews with prominent party leaders and have taken the liberty of compiling these interviews for you, the common rabble. I first sat down with a fine gentlemanly sort, Mr. Chive Horseradish Marjoram, an old guard type of fellow. I began by asking him for a brief history of the party and an explanation of where the party stands in relation to representation. Dave Camry advocates the establishment of an independent Welsh state within the European Union. The party was formed in 1925 and won its first seat in 1966. We have one of four Welsh seats in the European Parliament, three of 40 Welsh seats in the UK Parliament, 14 of 60 seats in the National Assembly for Wales, where we are the junior partner in the coalition government with the Welsh Labour Party, and 205 of 1,264 principal local authority councillors. According to accounts filed with the Electoral Commission for the year of 2004, we have an income and expenditure of about £500,000. This increased to 998000 in 2008. After my interview with Sir Marjoram, I had the opportunity to sit down with Mr. Mugwort Tarragon Cardamom, a fellow political analyst and specialist on the Play Camry's platform. Our platform includes promotion of the constitutional advancement of Wales with a view to attaining full national status for Wales within the European Union, ensuring economic prosperity, social justice, and health of the natural environment based on a decentralist socialism, building a national community based on equal citizenship, respect for these different traditions and cultures, and the equal worth of all individuals, whatever their race, nationality, gender, color, creed, sexuality, age, ability, or social background, creating a bilingual society by promoting the revival of the Welsh language, <laughs> promoting Wales' contribution to the global community, and to attain the membership of the United Nations. Now this all being jolly good, my work should have been done. A full day's work? Not quite, Speedy Simon. I craved yet another insight into the party. My research soon led me to Mr. Samuel Bayleaf Mustard, a man who knows prominent party leaders as well as he knows his own mother, children, and financial counselor. Yes, yeah, Samuel, right, who are the major political figures of the Plaid Kemmery? Plaid Kemmery leaders consist of Lewin Wynne Jones, who has been the party leader since 2006. He's the deputy first minister for Wales. A 2006 party reorganization de designated the group leader in the assembly as overall party leader. David Wigley is the former party president, and Jill Evans is the honorary pres party president. She was the president from 2010 member of the European Parliament. Elfin Lewid uh, is the UK Parliament group leader. Now what have we learned? Well, the Plague Camry is a party that focuses on the just cause of representing us, the Welsh people. As we've been fighting to become an independent state for some time now, the Plague Camry fights daily to accomplish just that. Its focus is on establishing Wales as a self-determining entity. Recently, in 2007, the Plaid Camry formed a coalition with the Labour Party and created the One Wales Programme, an agreement that bound both parties to support full legislative privileges for the Welsh Assembly. However, despite the support, the Plaid Camry lost footing in the 2010 general election and returned only three MPs. Three MPs. Three MPs. Ah! Three! Three MPs. Oh, I'm gonna switch it to Westminster. Hmm. Yeah. This has been Basil Peppermint Coriander in support of the Plate Cap. As always, the random bottom. Find out more.